Today, I'm going to break down exactly how I created this free AI SEO SaaS tool using Bolt.new. This is a brand new method. It's absolutely mind blowing how easy this is. You can see, for example, I just used this the first time this morning and I basically say create a SaaS tool. It generated all the code. You don't need to code or anything like that. It generated this SEO after, as you can see, select your model, select your API key, put in your keyword in some source context, slap in your site map if you want to, and you can generate content. And from what I can see, you can basically automate and create any SaaS tool that you can ever imagine in just a few minutes using AI. The other thing here is you can actually embed it to your website. So you can see here, for example, I've taken the code for the SEO article writer, plugged it into my website. It was super easy. Literally, all you do is you grab the iframe. And finally, if you just want to host it on a website or a domain, I'll show you exactly how to do it. Like you can see right here, just to be very clear here, like I didn't pay for bold.new. It doesn't cost a penny from what I can see. It generates SaaS tools in like a couple of clicks. And I'm going to break down the whole process, give you the SAP, give you all the prompts. And if you want to create your own SaaS tool or your own article writer that's custom tailored to you, your business, your needs, etc., then this is going to be a game changer. Bearing in mind as well, I know a lot of people watching this probably spend thousands of dollars on tools. Now you can create them for free, like you can see right here. And you don't need to do any coding. It's very, very simple with the power of AI. So let's get straight into it and exactly how it works. First thing you're going to want to do is you want to have a bolt.new account. This is free to sign up with. And once you've signed up, you're going to see a dashboard that looks like this. And it says, what do you want to build? You can prompt, run, edit, and deploy full stack web apps. So you can see here, for example, you got some options like build a mobile app, create a doc site, start a blog, etc. I can't believe that coding is this easy and it's so easy to create tools. Bear in mind, it seemed like magic to create a SaaS about 12 months ago. Now you can just automate it in one single click. Really, really cool. And so the example that I used is right here, and I'll give you access at the end of the video. SEO article writer, drop down box to select the preferred AI model. People have to plug in their API key. Ask them what they want to rank for, source context, specific workout, etc. Now, this is not just limited to content. You could create a tool, for example, for toggle maps or keyword research or calculators, whatever you want, whatever you can imagine. Then I gave some instructions that I usually use to write and rank content. And finally, we included some negative AI fluff words to avoid. Now, from there, you can tweak the prompt as much as you want. You can change it however you want. And you just go into bold, plug that in, paste, hit enter. And then what I actually went off and did was create this model right here. Now you can see I've actually used my maximum tokens for today. So on the free version, I think you can create like maximum one tool per day, but I'm going to upgrade just so that I can show you exactly how this works in real time and break down the chat history, etc. right? And so now I've upgraded just to show you purely for the video, everything I created, the tool that I created previously was complete free. And so now I'm going to copy the prompts. All the content creation ideas, etc., all the instructions from my document. We'll paste that into Bolt. And what you can see here is it's just automatically coding for us. It's even got the AI models at the top. So you can, for example, use an API key from Claude 2, Gemini Pro, etc. There'll be the options within the content writer. Now you can see there's a lot of files here and there's a lot of code, etc. I don't know how to code, but it's very easy to deploy this and I'll show you how in a minute. Additionally, you literally just sit there and watch it. It's kind of like using ChatGPT. Except that it's creating the code for you. It deploys a code for you. And all you need to do is just worry about actually communicating it in English directly inside the chat. So I pasted in the, so you've got prompts on the left-hand side. And now it's created the SEO article writer. It might take a couple of minutes to load this. There was a bit of blank space there for a minute or so. And then you can see here, we can select between the different models we want to use. If you want to change any of this, you can just go back and forth with both just like we were talking about previously. So for example, if you're like, oh, I want more API models to be included, then you just give the instructions to bolt down there. So as an example of that, we'll select GPT-4. I'm gonna plug in my API key here. There we go. Then you would just plug in your keyword. And bear in mind, like this is not magic. So when you're doing all of this, it's very easy to create the tool. Probably the 80, 20 of your time is in tweaking it and going back and forth with bolt in terms of how you want it specifically, right? So for example, it might miss a couple of instructions knowing what AI is like, or, or it might write the content, but it's not to your preferred word count. So just be prepared to go back and forth with Bolt as you create this. And now I'm going to add some source context. So we'll grab that from a previous prompt of mine. We'll plug that in there. And now we'll hit generate article. 
based on our target keyword, see what it comes back with. I actually found this on the, the first attempt that I did and also this attempt as well, is like it won't generate the content on the first preview of the tool. And so if you just say to Bolt, okay, it's not generating the content, then it's going to go back, tweak a few things and should create something that's actually a bit more usable. You can see here, it's actually including the prompts inside the code for writing the content. So it's got like specific guidelines on how to write the content, which is good to know that it's actually using the prompts you're recommending to it. Whilst that's loaded, let me show you this as well. So it's super easy to just get the iframe code directly from Bol, and then you can launch out on your website. Another idea is that you, this is a test domain, but you can actually link Netify to a domain that you buy, and then that will redirect to the embedded version of the tool. So like, if you just want to send people to one single place with the tool on side it, or you want to share this with your team, et cetera, you can see that. The other cool thing here is it's got a writing style guide. So you can see what prompts are used during the content creation. And now it's come back with the second version of our AI SaaS tool. So let's give it a whirl. It might be temperamental, but let's see what happens next. And this time around is actually generate the content as you can see, and it's generated in Markdown code. I'll be a hundred percent honest. It's not used the recommended word count that I asked it to generate. So you can see here in the word counter, uh, word count is 484 words, which is not great. So just be prepared to like go back and forth. I'll probably have to say to Bolt in a minute, like make sure you do use the word count I recommend. But the fact that it's just so easy to, to create a SaaS tool kind of makes a lot of SaaS tools irrelevant. Like you can just create your own personalized SaaS tool. You can create your own personalized SEO content writer one single click in a few minutes using Bolt, you can deploy it, you can embed it to your website, you can share it with your team, and you're not spending like thousands of dollars per year on generating content or whatever else you want to automate with AI. Uh, you can also see if we zoom in here on the content, it's like, hey, I'm Julian Goldie, AI CEO expert with over seven years of experience, the seven figure, um, seven figure earnings, et cetera. Today, I'm talking about the, and then it inserts a keyword. Content itself is not bad. I wouldn't say it's amazing. You get a feel for how easy it is to create the content. Like for example, here it says what makes SEO Elite Circle the best SEO training in Birmingham. So it's got like keyword. So it's customized the content to my SEO training program that I sell. And then it's also included the content inside the title as well. Now, I haven't obviously it's included a few, but it has wiped out most of the AI fluff and it's nicely formatted, etc. I mean, as an example of that, Let's take that markdown code, as you can see, we'll preview that. So I'm going to delete the previous content. So we'll plug in the markdown from the AI code generator directly into the preview. And you can see it's just created like a nicely formatted block, right? Nice titles, nice bullet points, all customized to me, my brand, etc. Kyle, all the AI flub, include some FAQs, add a nice conclusion. And additionally, it's linked internally to my funnels as well. So. It just gives you a feel for how easy it is to create this content, how fast it can be generated, how easy it is to create a tool. As you saw with the first version of the tool that I created, it was completely free. You can create like one free tool a day from what I can see. You get a limited number of tokens, but then also if you generally want to generate like tons of SaaS tools, then you could easily just upgrade for like $20 a month. And I'm pretty sure you could actually like sell some of these SaaS tools. I think people will pay good money for stuff like this, but I want to give it away to you for free. And I want to show you exactly how to do it for free. Really, really cool stuff. We could go back and forth with it. So we could say like, okay, it's not using the specified word count. So please fix that. And maybe there's something else we could say is like also include input box for URLs I want to link internally to from my article. Then we'll enter and it will just update everything, rewrite everything based on what's already working. And I feel like I don't have to worry about coding again. Also, just whilst I'm waiting for that to load, I want to give credit here to Words at Scale because he's the legend who actually came up with this tutorial. I'd never used Bolt before today. Okay, let's implement that ASAP and it works like magic. So check out his channel, awesome stuff. Let's get back to the tool now. So you can see he's still rewriting it. It does take a couple of minutes to rewrite some of the code. If it finds any errors itself, like here, you can just click on fix problem and it should resolve some of the problems. So it can kind of like fix itself, problem solve, etc. Also, what you can also do is like, if you see an issue within the tool yourself that you don't like, you can take a little screenshot and then upload that directly into Bolt and ask it to fix it based, say like you want to improve something on the UI. I think you can also change like the colors, the design, etc. as well, just to make it look a lot nicer. But yeah, absolutely amazing. I've not properly explored 
the potential of Bolt Dot Noon, but I'm very, very excited to test more stuff out on it. So let's go back. So let's test it again now. We'll select our model. I'm actually, I'm going to select GPT 3.5 and you can see here it's updated. So you can add like internal links. You can add the source context. I'm sure there's better ways to insert the internal links, but you get the idea. So what I'm actually going to do is I'll plug in the URL and then I'll put SEO case studies as an example URL. And I, you can also add multiple links here. What you could also do is add like a section for entities and semantics if you want to optimize for that too. And then we'll hit generate article. Now, whilst we're waiting for that to load, what I also think would be really cool for some ideas of SaaS tools is like you look at what tools you're paying for currently, and then you look at, okay, can Bolt realistically do that itself, right? So for example, could you create a tool for topple maps? Could you create a tool for keyword research, site audits, analyzing search console data, et cetera, even like keyword clustering, or for example, like link building prospecting, there's so many different tasks that you could use Bolt for. The other cool thing about this is uh, if you want to share it, or if you want to use it as a lead magnet or even sell your own tools, once you've tested that it works properly, the cool thing here is it's not going to cost you any money because the user inserts their own API key in here. So they can insert their own API key. That means they're using their own credits and bear in mind like API key credits are super cheap. Anyway, you're talking like probably cents to generate an article and that way you don't get charged, but you can share it with other people. You can see here, for example, like, let's say you have an error like this one that popped up. So I just took a screenshot, pasted it into the chat, typed in troubleshoot, and then it will fix the problems with the tool and regenerate the code. Now, like I say, it requires a lot of back and forth does require a bit of messing around, but you get the idea of how easy it is to set these up. Now, what you can also do once you've got this set up is you can say, right, I want to embed it to my website. Another really cool thing is, is like if you tweak the tool, but you don't like where it's at after the new tweaks, you can just roll back to a checkpoint so you can revert back to the version that was actually working, which is super useful. And then once you're ready to go, you can just hit deploy and you can see that's basically deploying the tool to Netify. And then what you'll see after the deployment. So once you click this is uh, you can click here and you'll see your tool is embedded on like a test website. You can also go on to Netify and then redirect that to an actual domain that you own. Now, if you want to embed it to your website, you can just say, give me the iframe code to embed to my site. It'll give you this iframe code. And then if you go to your WordPress website, so for example, let's just take a random page like this. You can see I've already inserted one here. The way that I did that was I just went to text, scroll down to code section, and then from here, put in the iframe code. And now you can see that's embedded on the website. Now we can take that for a little spin. So we've got the model setting set up, the API key, content parameters, and the content is generated like so. Like you can see right here, all the content's customized to my business, my keyword. It's got links to my website, which actually work. And then FAQs and everything else. So really, really cool stuff. Amazing that you can do that with Bolt and just so easy to do. So thanks so much for watching. As promised, I've shown you how to create free SaaS tools with Bolt.new. I've shown you how to deploy shown them, showing you how you can create your own tools for whatever you want, plus how you can embed them directly to your website to generate content or whatever you want to do. Now, what I've actually done is for the prompt that I used today for creating my own tool. And also if you want a step-by-step -step friendly SOP that shows you exactly how to do this yourself, feel free to check out the video notes from today, teach you everything step-by-step. -step. And you can just copy and steal the whole process from me. What I'm actually going to do is I will copy the SOP as you can see, and just plug that into my free SEO course link in the comments and description. Once you've logged in, go to the free SEO course, free SEO tools category, and then bold.new and you'll find the video notes right there. Bear in mind this free course, it comes with nearly 170 lessons on SEO, tips, tutorials, SAPs, workflows, everything is free inside here. And feel free to get that link in the comments and description of this video. Now, if you want to get a free SEO strategy session on how to get more leads, traffic and sales for your website, feel free to book that in link in the comments and description. We'll show you how we take websites from zero to 145,000 visitors a month and generate thousands of dollars in sales on autopilot. This free link building acceleration session will give you a free SEO domination plan. You'll discover the secrets of link building. We'll answer any questions you have. You'll learn the best link building strategy for your website, how to quickly outrank your competitors with link building and how to 10x your SEO traffic based on what's working for us. Feel free to check that out. Link in the comments and description. Appreciate you watching. Bye-bye.